good. Okay. <laughs> 913 here, the Frozen Bun Run is celebrating 40 years and shows no signs of slowing down. It's held every year at Bethel Island with tons of delicious food and drink, as well as some crazy costumes. <laughs> we sent Sabrina Silva there because she's our bravest reporter. <laughs> <laughs> and she's reporting live from this wild event. Oh, hey, yes. And, uh, I'm actually keeping my buns warm alongside <laughs> a couple that of the wave boarders that are going to be hitting the cold water out there with their frozen buns. Thank you guys for joining us this morning. Happy New Year, by the way. Okay, so these are literally kids. They're going to be out there water skiing or water wave boarding. Okay, so they're wave boarders, and that's their wave boards right there. So they're doing it in style. But is this your first one to do it? Yeah. Okay. Your first yeah. one too? First for everybody. Okay, okay. So here's my question though for you. How do you plan to keep yourself warm out there in that water? Um, not falling. Not falling. Okay, I like that. For you, why do something like this? Because it's a good way, a good crazy way to start off the year. <laughs> okay. Now Question for you, gentlemen. Are any of you showing off your burger buns? No. Heck no. Heck no. No, no, nope, nope, and no. Nope. So they're gonna be dressed, but guess what? There's a hundred dollars prize being given out to the person that shows the most. And <laughs> I honestly don't know why this is our first time being here. This is just like good day in one big pot of people. I, I love it. I agree. I really love it. And you know what? We've been seeing people out with costumes. Check out that guy over there, McCain. He's got this pink onesie. And uh, the first uh, wave border water skier is actually going to get to go in just a couple of minutes, right? Yes. Okay, and this is the 40th year that you guys have been doing this. But why do you think it's become such a big staple for people from all over Northern California and some parts of the world? It's just a great opportunity for people to meet new people and they come out, have fun. I mean, everybody gets along with everybody. It's a family event. Kids get to come out and check things out. And I mean, you get to go out in the water. It may be cold, but it teaches <laughs> also, it's teaching kids like wakeboarding, fun sports. I mean, you have motorcycles out here. It's everybody from every type of everything. Yeah. And that's the cool thing. I mean, it's not every day that you see bikers and young kids and crazy people like myself out here all together in harmony. And uh, I love this because you even got some parents out here, right? Look, the, some kiddos. So you guys brought your kids out here to spend the New Year's. Is this your first time doing it? No? Okay, how many times have you done it so far? Probably three or four. Three or four years? Okay, well, best of luck out there, guys. Let, oh, don't be shy. Yeah, that's how you start 2020, confidence. Well, we're going to be out here to watch the skiers go out in the water. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay. Thank you oh, very shit. much.